The Blue Room is iconic. It's steeped in history. To have a mural in a football stadium was just unheard of. Nobody did that. The whole stadium, everywhere I look, there is a memory of something or somebody. I've never actually counted how many portraits are there. It feels quite emotional. I just spent so much time in here. So to see them again is um, it's lovely. But my heart's pumping. <laughs> My name's Senga Murray and I was an artist in residence at Rangers Football Club for over 20 years. That was the very, very first one that I did. The Pioneers, that's called. I joined the club around about 1987. To have an artist in residence, no other football club did that. Rangers had a vision. For that next decade, it was the, probably the most exciting time to be around a, a football club. Not that I have favourites as such, but I do love Lorenzo Amaro, so I must admit. <laughs> I must admit. <laughs> it's the original interior design of the Blue Room. Before I got my paintbrush on it. <laughs> That's really where new players were introduced to the public and the press and the new manager. New player manager, same city. When I was asked to do the murals, my daughter was just born and two weeks later I got the phone call. I was up scaffolding practically. I did study a technique that Leonardo da Vinci used in the Sistine Chapel because I used this original uh, mosaic on this one, that one, that one, all of them. He would do an initial drawing and then do like a stencil and then enlarge that and then put that up on the wall. I can show you how this would work. That's the original cartoon and it meant that I could have a, a sort of plan of the proportions and the portraits, where they were going to go, how I was going to do it. I've always been a Rangers fan. Purely and simply because of my dad. We were season ticket holders for 15 years. To tell my dad that I was working for Rangers Football Club it was just absolutely amazing. I've always seen a connection between art and football. There is an artistry in football I can, I can see it. I would say, out of everything that I've done, I think the Blue Room, that's the pinnacle. I walk in there and I, I get goosebumps. I'm extremely proud, extremely proud. And I hope in years to come, when my daughter and my son, when they bring their children, they'll look at the Blue Room murals and they'll still be there, hopefully, and they'll say, yeah, your granny did that.